It's DD Kano, back today with another video. Choose out to everybody tuning in. If you are squad, smash the subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, and do not skip those ads. It is September 28th, and it's time for us to get to this bag. In this video, guess what, baby? We gonna make a quick $200 in less than four hours. We gonna get that money shower. Again, if you are squad, smash that subscribe button, give me, oh, wait, 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 wait. One more thing. We are gonna do story time, so make sure you stay tuned to the full video. And if you are subscribed, smash that subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, and do not skip those ads. We about to pull on right now, so we get to this bag. Let's go. I got the jankiest card I can get, baby. This joint is extra janky. This joint is extra jank. We gotta hurry up and uh, get this done so we can get on the run so we can have some fun. I know we gotta go to the liquor aisle. Y'all know y'all like my style. So we're gonna get some vodka. Vodka's over here. Wham. The vodka. Um, it's some vodka I have never even seen before. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't even know how to pronounce this joint. It started with a. Comment below, let me know if you ever had some of this vodka. It's like Poland vodka, that's what it says on here. Where are you doing that, baby? Where you at, where you at? 750 milliliters. Hit him with the scan, Ski. That's not it. This how I look. Am I tweaking? Am I tweaking? Am I, that's exactly how it looks. Oh, no, that's not it. I'm tweaking. I am tweaking. So, where that joint at, baby? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at, baby? I'm looking for you. I'm looking for, oh, right. this one it? This is it right here. Hit with the scan, Ski. Yep, <laughs> that's the joint. I'm gonna put it right here. Like I'm walking around drinking. Then we need to get some Coors Light. 16 ounce, 12 pack of Coors Light. Comment below and let me know if you've had some Coors Light before. I've never had them before. I do know that they have some exclusive thing with it where when it's cold, it like turns blue. So maybe it's not this, maybe it's cans. Is it can oh, it's cans. Uh, cans to get these bands, you understand? Scan again. Hit it with the scan, Ski. On my phone tweaking. Okay. Then with the scan ski, proceed to check out. Now we go. Proceed to check out. Y'all know the route, baby. We get this money. Gotta get this money. Understand me. Understand me. Every walk go, I spend a lot of cash. <laughs> spend no flex, spend no flex and get it back. OTF up there, been at that. Smoking on this, I call it the snake pack. Counting some much money that my fingers cramp. I want Nick Wally, you don't get it down. Extra man, she do Jizz baby, so baby. Y'all know about that. Comment below, let me know if y'all know about that. Comment below and let me know what sun that is. I know some of my subscribers know about that. I didn't get this money, understand me. Understand me. Hello. How you doing, Nancy? I'm doing great, I can't complain, I'm still living. The rest is up to us. Yes, ma'am. I look that young. <laughs> you look so young. <laughs> Here you go. That's a good thing, right? I guess so. that's what they say. Just so you know, this one is a DoorDash order. Okay. Thank you very much. Then my red card here. Please don't tell me. So do you put in your your four four fours? Oh, the five five five. Yeah, well, it's a 444 one also. The 444 one is Instacart. Oh, Instacart. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so you're doing fives. Um, yes, ma'am. And is yours tax exempt, though? Yes. Just help me 
help me because I can never do this. Well, hey, we all have to learn one day. And it's kind of confusing well, too. Keep it, yep. So, all right, there's the number. So now I gotta go to tax exempt. And with the swipe, ski. <laughs> Swipe that joint. Do you need this in a plastic bag as well, or just? No, like that's this? fine. You can just, just leave it like that. Okay. Have a great day. Thank you very much. You too. Take care. Don't work too hard now. Right. You won't. You won't. It's gonna go by fast, and it's gonna, you're gonna have a blast. You have a good one. I have my wrist all lights, no chief keeper. That's that shit they don't like. Do I look like I can stay on my grizzly, bitch? I look like a bear. This my air, and I don't share. So what? Don't tear this bitch down, Mr. D.O.F. But he's so fresh, can't get it right. D so left. That's playing game shit. How you doing this morning? I'm living a dream. I can't complain. Man, me too. We bro. both woke up, so hey. And I hope you're gonna enjoy this for me too. Oh no, actually it's for later on. Oh, but hey, you getting it early. Yeah. So you don't have to worry about it later. Oh, that's because it's not a driver. Yeah, that's a bad yeah. yeah. I always forget to switch it sometimes. There you go. All right, brother. Have a good one. You have a great one, sir. Thank you. Order number two. Y'all know what it's time to do. Comment below and let me know. It's time to do the liver that if you don't like it, I will lean the left. It could be in the back then. Give me, give me, give me. This one is from Tacos of North. And guess what? The order cost is $183. We holla. We pop it our collar. Estimated distance is 16.7 miles and the driving time is 21 minutes. Y'all know we about to get in it. Look, the delivery commission is $7.83 plus an extra mileage commission of $6.70 plus a minimum of $17 tip off the rear to little flip, which equals a total of a minimum of $31.53. Hey, we run around in the tent. Hey, comment below and let me know if you think it's a good order or not. Also, if you guys want to sign up for delivering out, if you don't like it, well, lean the luck. All you have to do is click the link in the description and hey, sign up so you can go ahead and get this money. Let's go. Just like that, we are here to get this uh, delivered. If you want to tell me, leave me like, be in the back, saying, give me, give me, give me. Don't even know that, you just want to watch your mom. Give me that. What y'all know about that? You niggas can't stop my grind. You better off trying to stop my shine. Say you can stop my flying. Scratch that, homie, stop that line. I know your type. You are not that kind. You ain't about that flight. Fresh checks, you ain't about dope. Okay, so I'm going to put them all in these bags right here, so. And so I, you think I should put it in the car so it don't tip over at all? I put it in the car. Yeah. Put it in the car. This one is special. It's the soft one. Okay. Oh no, this one. This right here. You can get to give me this one. I set this on top of the car and then I put it in the bag on the bottom. Right there. So this one don't tip over. No. And this one. Oh, not my finger. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, put this here. Bam. I'll just have her hold this one, so. Oh, I'll put it in the cup holder. I'll put it in the cup holder. All right, thank you very much. You have a good one. Put it in the cup holder. She got to get right, baby. So, I don't know. It's like, this stuff is like, I don't want to make them lean over. I don't want to lean back. Lean back like Fat Joe. We don't want no problem like we had that one time. Remember what happened to the last, the last, that one order <laughs> with that ranch dressing. Okay, put this here. Bam, put it up a little bit. Um, that one got a little weight to it too. Let's see if I can fit this right here. That joint fit right there. Dang it. Okay, so I'm gonna put this here. I don't think it'll, I think it'll be moved or less if I have it in the trunk. That's just what I think. Comment below and let me know if I'm tweaking or not. Or maybe, I, no, I'm just putting it in the back seat, man. Look, we ain't got time to be playing no games. We're trying to do our thing. We ain't got time to be playing no games. Put this here. Leaning my seat back and all that. That's what I get. Leaning my seat back and all that. So boom, we got the chips off the rip. Shout out to Lil Flip. Okay, so we're gonna put, this is what we're gonna do, right? 
we're gonna set the chips right here like this. Wham, right? Wham, that way. Put that right there. Put this back in here. And we do have another little box thing. Did it tip it in there? Or should I put this? Yeah, put that right there sideways. Boys in the days, sitting sideways. And then we can put this last thing in here. That joint's smelling good. I ain't gonna lie to you. Got like that bang. You niggas can't share my air. I walk a mile in the pair I wear. Niggas can't stop my grind. You better off trying to stop my shine. Say you can stop my flying. Stretch that, homie. Stop that. Of course they do. Yeah. Okay, so you, you have a cart, right? I don't. No? <laughs> if you want, uh, I can give you this wagon and you can roll it so it can okay, make it way yeah, easier so for you. Bring it back down for you. Is yeah. this heavy or? Okay. Well, so there's that and everything too. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I don't know why they. <laughs> Make it so hard for you. Yeah, although, like, even as a wrap to get in and everything, they're like, you have to call it for. But any patient can walk in. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so this bag has everything in there. I'll okay. put this right here. And then, uh, where should I put? Yeah, so just on top of me, okay? It's but not too far from the elevator, at least. So. Okay. So this is the salsa, so okay. you gotta make sure you don't. Maybe we can see it right here. Yeah, it should be all right, right there. Right, yeah. Got some ice cream. Close it in a little bit. Perfect. Alrighty. Okay, and then I'll just bring the wagon right yes, here. Yes, ma'am. All right, thank you. Bring the bag too. Oh yeah, oh. done. <laughs> Welcome. Like, you have a great day. Trip. <laughs> <laughs> you have a good. You get good exercise. Yes, ma'am. Got that wagon. Got uh, this wagon. <laughs> Close that joint up. This wagon saves lives, baby. I don't know how she was gonna be able to take it all. She would have had to pay multiple trips if she didn't have a wagon, baby. If we wasn't bragging and we ain't had that wagon, or she would have had to uh, just use the bag and then bring the bag back. But it would have been awkward carrying it, baby. Let's go. It is MCR and we are now back in the car. We're not going that far, but we soon like stars to Mars. You know I got them bars like Bruno. My pocket's fat like sumo, baby. <laughs> that boy rhyming. We are now in the drive-thru to pick up the specimens. And we about to make this 160 right quick. Um, we got to pick up at 6 o'clock on the dock. We in a hard top cruising the street. And guess what? Guess what I'm going to tell you guys about story time. Story time is going to be of me before I started doing drop off. Guess what? Like some years ago, my name was Mr. Drop Off. I'm going to explain everything to you guys and how I was out there getting busy, baby. I hope you guys are with me. I hope you guys are joining this video. Also, I want to say I appreciate every last one of you for smashing that subscribe button. I appreciate every last one of you for coming below and smash that like button, baby. I'm making this box right now so we can go ahead and get busy right quick. So when the boxes come, they come flat. rat a tat tat You know I keep the mat. 10, we are here getting it in. Put that. We got to hit him with the Skansky. Uh, hit him with the Skansky. Hit him with the phone and all that stuff. But we are here. We're about to go out here and get busy. I hope you guys are with me. We're about to move kind of swiftly. Let's go. We are here to pick up the specimen, baby. Hello. I'm going to get busy right quick. Remember that, Mom? That's the Just like that, wow. We got them joints in the back seat. We running it up like a track meet. Our next stop is 33 minutes away, 22 miles. Y'all know we about to go wild, and I hope y'all like my style. Let's go. Stop that line. I know your type. You are not that kind. You ain't about that flight. Fresh checks. You ain't about those nights. I spit facts. You ain't about what you write. You ain't about those dice. Treating you nice because they want that pipe. I'm Teddy D, baby. Turn out the lights. T -t Turn up my mic. ATL slang, bitch. I'm bite. So stop fretting, nigga. We are here at stop number two. Y'all know what it's time to do. It's time to get busy. So come on. Uh, let me see. I gotta put the cold in. That cold in, baby. Comment below and let me know if we have more than other, the other ones. <laughs> oh, the other one had more this time. We only got one in this job. Who knows? Oh, gotta hit him with photo. Thank you for choosing. Hit him with photo. Man! Let's go. Oh, 
you ready? It is time, baby, to find out why my name was meant to drop off. So, we are doing drop off right now, but before, way, 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 many moons ago, baby, my name was meant to drop off because I used to sell replica clothes. I'm gonna break down everything, how I got started and all that stuff, right? So, boom, this was back in the day. I met this dude that I know, I met him actually on Facebook. He was messing with the cars and all that stuff. He used to uh, do cars and all that stuff. So I, hit, I linked up with him on, when I, this was back, back when I was in Job Corps. So I hit him up, I come home, we chop it up, we kick it a few times, boom. He put me on this this uh, lady who sells the clothes, baby. So again, these are all replica clothes. And before I even get to the story, I just want to tell you guys that yes, I did make sure I let everybody know that this is replica stuff. That this is not the real thing, but I had to get that green, baby. So, show me later with the clothes, I go buy stuff, right? So, I buy stuff a few times, so I'm gonna get fresh nasty. I got wide sale belt buckles. Y'all, so looking. Wide sale belt buckles, North Face. I'm talking about, I'm getting fresh nasty, baby. So, go over there. We steady keep going over there. We go there a few times. I get some more stuff, some more stuff, right? And just so you guys know, also, I wanna tell you guys this. Well, why would you wear fake clothes and all that stuff? Look, man, look. It ain't about what you're wearing, it's who's wearing it, baby. And I've never been one to front act like it was real and when it wasn't. Cause why, I, I don't understand why somebody would pay, you know, four, five, six, seven hundred, eight hundred dollars for a belt. Comment below, let me know. I don't know. But back to the story, right? So boom, we're going over there, going over there. So I'm trying to top it up with her, the lady with the clothes. I'm like, yeah, so let me buy you. I'm gonna give you some money so you can give me the plug so I can get my old clothes so I can boom start selling them. Cause everybody already know I was first dancer. I've been first dancer for a long time. So boom, so I can start selling myself. See steady. Procrastinate, no, no, no. So this goes on for years. She's steady not trying to give me the plug, right? So, it comes down to a point. One time she had some leftover stuff, she gave me the stuff. Well, she didn't give it to me. It's like she not fronted it to me, but she gave it to me and I had to go sell it to bring the money back, but I had my own money, so it was kind of like weird. So, she would not give me that plug, baby. She wouldn't give me that plug for nothing. Boom. I get the stuff, I go crazy. I sell stuff, I boom, 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 boom. Go crazy, right? Come back, give her money, and I come back. I'm only, I only make like 200 measly dollars. Actually, I just sold about six, seven hundred dollars worth of stuff. Quick too. So I steady keep asking the time, old time, old time, old. Guess what, baby? She finally let me get in. <laughs> she finally let me get in, baby. So she let me order this stuff. She's having, she's calling these people in New York. She's telling me, all send me the pictures, of all the stuff that they got, and then I used to tell her exactly what I want. I used to buy cases of stuff. So I'm gonna tell you guys all the stuff I had. I'm talking about, I was going crazy. I had everything you can imagine. I had North Faces. I have North Face hoodies. I had polo jogging suits. I had um, um, designer watches. I had designer purses. I had Uggs. I had Tims. I had Uggs, Tims, Gucci scarf sets. Gucci with the Gucci hat and the Gucci scarf. I had that. I had polo coats. I had um, perfume. I had cologne. I had, I got pictures. I'm, I'm gonna be sending these pictures in there too. What else I had? I had true religions. I had Robin jeans. I had true religions whole fits with the hoodie and everything. I had uh, the Gucci, Louis, Prada, Fendi, all uh, Ferragamo, all the belts, all the belts. I had I had so much stuff. So this is what I was doing, baby. I was putting a lot of work in too. I was out there. I was going crazy, baby. I was putting a lot of work in. But what I would do is she uh, get the stuff for me. I tell her everything I want. I used to get cases of stuff. I'm getting some prices. For the Tims, I'm talking about these Tims look just like the real deal too. Timberlands, seventy-five dollars. Uggs, sixty-five dollars. The watches was fifty dollars. The uh, North Faces was fifty dollars. The purses was fifty dollars. Um, Cologne perfume was like twenty, thirty dollars, depending on what it was. Um, what else? What I had? True Religion, fifty dollars. The whole fit for the seventy-five dollars. I'm talking about. I was out there going crazy. So boom, this is what I used to do every day, right? I used to go to work. When I get off work, if I, had to, if I had a shipment to go pick up, I used to go to her crib, boom. She was to her crib, because they used to, to send it in the mail. Go to her crib, pick up the stuff, right? So when I get there, I'll take the pictures of everything. And then I had a list. I used to like, like, Uggs. I used to write down all the sizes I had, boom, 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 boom. I got all these sizes. Then I used to go on my Facebook and post up everything. Post up everything I had, post up the price, and post up the sizes I got. Boom. Then my, and I put my phone number in there. Then guess what? my phone start ringing off the hook. Now I'm going crazy. This is the area I cover. From, from North Chicago, Illinois, all the way to Racine, Wisconsin. It's probably North Chicago, Waukegan, Zion, Gurney. These are the cities. North Chicago, Waukegan, Zion, Gurney, Winter Harbor, 
Pleasant Prairie, Kenosha, Racine. Eight, I had eight, I was covering eight areas, baby. And shout out to some of my guys, they just come from Milwaukee, shoot down here and meet me at the mall. I just give them stuff too, but I was going crazy. Every single day, I post the stuff up, people call my phone, boom. I was going so crazy, right? My mom had to start answering my comments on my Facebook. She had to run my Facebook, and she had to try to tell me the navigation, I needed to go over here. And my name was Mr. Drop Off because guess what? I used to pull right up to your house. You ain't got to come out no more. You ain't got to do nothing. All you got to do is have that money. I'm pulling right up to your door. You're going to come out there. You're going to get the stuff that you want. Boom, boom, boom. I got the whole truck filled. I had the Buick, 97 Buick Park Avenue. The whole back seat filled. I'm talking about filled up. Whole truck filled up. I used to go crazy every single day. Every day, I would go crazy. Then the next day, I would tell them, yeah, I'm getting off work at 2.30. I used to work from, what time I used to work? 6 to 2.30. 6 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. After that, I'm going crazy. Sometimes I used to come home like at 3.30 in the morning. Guess what? Go to sleep for maybe like an hour or two, get back up, go to work, do it again. So, before I was making only like $200 for you, I'm talking about I was doubling up. My first batch, I spent $1,900. I made, I made my money back the same day. Spent the money, made my money, uh, went crazy, uh, made my money back that day. So I used to go crazy, and I pretty much used to double up on everything. So whatever stuff that cost, I used to double up on it. So the Uggs, well not the Uggs, the Uggs probably was like $35 a piece. And I used to sell them for the 65. Then I used to sell them with the Uggs, with the North. I used to, man, I, man, I was going crazy. My name was Mr. Drop Off. And it was called the Rome Special. So a lot of these times, a lot of times in these videos, when I be switching up my name, DDK, it's all about branding. DDK, MCR. I was also, I had a lot of names. So I was Mr. Drop Off. That's when I was selling the clothes. I was real to Rome when I was selling the houses. Uh, I still sell the houses too. I, I switched to real to Rome. I was landlord Rome and I was being a landlord. Um, I was DDK, DoorDash King, when I'm uh, doing DoorDash. I'm um, MCR when I'm doing the medical care. And so you gotta switch it up. It's all about branding and stamping your name. So um, yeah, I pretty much was going crazy every single day, putting a lot of hard work, a lot of dedication in. I was going nuts, baby. But all good things must come to an end when y'all thinking them dividends. So this is what happened, right? First up, before I even get to that, I just want to say huge shout out to her. I, she probably never watching this video. Huge shout out to the lady with the clothes because she gave me the opportunity. She had to give me the opportunity. But sometimes when people get that money, they get to acting a little funny, right? So this is what happened. Every time I used to go crazy, it used to be probably when I first started, it was like in the summer, in the summer, then it started, it started getting right into fall. I used to go crazy, 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 crazy. Right when tax time come, guess what happened? She get that money. She get to acting funny. She get that text money. Let's see you know I'm here for him for a while. I hit her up, hit her, hit her up. She don't, I don't hear from him for a while. So that happened two two times. I was doing this probably like for a year and a half. Two, nah. I was doing I was doing it heavy for probably like six months, five months. Then that text time came around. Then she stopped stopped stop fooling with me. Then I had to wait till the next text time. And then the same thing happened again until we got into it one time. And then that was the end of that, baby. And the thing about it was, it was never like I was trying to take her customers under. I had my own stuff. I was doing my own stuff. I was out there getting busy by myself. I ain't never step on her toes. I ain't never go to none of her customers. We I mean, wasn't even really kind of going to the same area. She was used to go like to Skokie. Like she was from Skokie. So her RP was on the Skokie. She used to go out to Skokie and get busy out there. And she used to sell some people around here. But honestly, I really wasn't selling that much to around here. I'm going to tell you this. When I, I want to just say a huge shout out right now. Stop the video. Huge shout out. To everybody in Racine, Wisconsin. I was going so crazy in Racine, Wisconsin, that guess what? I was thinking about getting an apartment out there. I was going there, that's how I noticed I was going. Then I had my little setup, I had little setups, right? So first I used to just go boom, 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 boom. I'm talking about, and somebody in North Chicago was over, which is over here, called me, I go there, and somebody in Racine come, called me, I go all the way over here, then walk I go back and forth, back and forth. So then I had start getting a setup because I was wasting too much time and wasting too much gas, right? So I started setting it up. My job was in the startup room, which is right by Racine, right? So what I used to do is, I used to tell everybody, I'm getting up at 2.30, I'm going to be in Racine for one to two hours. Then I was messing with this girl in Racine, so I used to steal up her spot, uh, still over there, boom, boom, boom. See right there, then I had my, my place was in, West, in Kenosha. So I used to go two hours, an hour, two hours, an hour like that, to each spot. So I told you guys all about the good, I, got, I do have to tell you guys about some bad too, I can't just give you the one side of the story, baby. Guess what? Somebody did take me up top and gave me a fake dub ski before, baby. Somebody did give me a fake dub ski before. This is how I found out, right? I didn't even know it was a fake dub ski. So after after I got the fake dub, I'm gonna tell you guys what I did. I went to the uh, the, I think I went to CVS or Walgreens. I got the little marker with the, the light on it too, so you can know if it's real or not. But this is what happened, right? I got the money. This is actually on my first run. When I spent the 1900 to get the box to get everything I needed, 
I went to the bank to send the money to her. I used to have to put the money in her bank account, right? Boom. I go to the bank. The bank, I go to the drive through get them the money. Guess what? They told me to come in the bank. I'm like, I don't know what's going on. Like, yeah, this is a fake $20 bill. I said I had no clue. They pretty much took the thing and they just pretty much kept it. That's pretty much what they got to do. I had to sign off on this paper and all that stuff. I told them I don't know how I got in there, but they asked what they got in there. But that's that's not even that bad of a thing because I, I made a lot of money doing it and I only got one fake dub ski. Also, guess what else? This is what happened. So, when I was doing all the stuff on my Facebook, I also used to post stuff in like the uh, the garage sales and the sales, and sales like the uh, groups and stuff, right? Guess what, man? Them people got the hate on me, boy. They got the hate. They tell me they gonna call Michael Kors, North Face, and all that stuff on me because I was in there getting busy. But I, again, like I told you guys before, I was telling everybody this stuff was rap because I was not trying to finesse people and tell them it was real when it wasn't, baby. That's one thing I never do. You gotta be honest while you're here hustling. And if you want to buy, you gonna buy it. If you don't, you don't, baby. It is what it is. So I used to go out there and get busy, and that's why my name was Mr. Drop Off. I, I I did the Mr. Drop Off. I had the name of Mr. Drop Off because I was dropping it off right to your door. And then the hat, I used to have a hashtag that's called Rome Special. It was the Rome Special. It was called the Rome Special. Cause my name, my nickname was Rome. For those of you who don't know, it was called the Rome Special. And you telling my guy Keith, he the one that came up with the Rome Special name. He the one that came up with the name, and I kind of uh, put the twist on it. And then I was getting busy ever since then. So that's exactly what happened. That's why I was meant to drop off. I have plenty of other stories of other things I have done. I also used to sell replica shoes, like when I was in high school. I got a whole bunch of stuff, man. I, I got a whole bunch. Of, I got a whole bunch of stuff. Comment below and let me know if you like the story time. Comment up below if you guys think I should tell you more stories about stuff I used to do to hustle and get that money, baby. And another thing I want to say is, I've always thought outside of the box. I've always did the opposite of what everybody else did. When everybody else was selling dope, I wasn't selling none. I was doing this. When everybody, when I was a job, when everybody else was selling weed, I was selling the switchers. So I always just thought outside the box because I felt like, why do I want to be like everybody else? When everybody else go left, I always go right. That's just what I do. That's why I haven't been buying no uh, real estate properties right now because everybody turned into gurus. Everybody's the biggest investors. Everybody. So that's when you don't, you want to try to chill out. And the interest rates are very high right now. So I've been trying to chill out, but if a good deal come, I am going to buy some. But I haven't been looking at it heavy like I used to because it's time to switch it up. So, you know. Comment below and let me know if you like the story time. I'm about to put up the CVS. Put the haters to rest. Let's go! You niggas can't share my air. I walk a mile in the pair I wear. You niggas can't share my air. I walk a mile in the pair I wear. We out here, baby. As you guys can see, we are at the airport. <coughs> you know what I'm talking about? We came out here and get busy. Guess what? It only took us about an hour and 15 all together to get to Cheddar. We're from the first stop to the second stop to here, baby. Hour and 15 minutes. We're going to make 160. I hope you guys are with me. We moved kind of swiftly. We are here waiting for her to get here right now. Hopefully, she get here early today, baby. We're trying to get in and get out like a bank robbery, baby. But I hope you guys are enjoying the video. Again, make sure you smash the subscribe button. Make sure you give me a thumbs up. And do not skip those dads. We out here at the airport getting to this bag. Let's go. I like have my wrists all lights. No chief keeper. That's that shit. They don't like it. And just like that, it is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the content. Guess what? We were out there, we got busy. We made 202 28. We came to get that cake. We didn't do good. We did great. We tried to get back to that 200 plus a day to keep these haters away. Honestly, my goal is to one day soon to make a thousand dollars per day get the clap of ABA Bay. So comment below and let me know if you think it's gonna happen or not. Again, if you are subscribed, smash the subscribe button, give me a thumbs up and do not skip those ads and lock it tomorrow because we get back to this bag. Why we get back to this bag? The 2022 is still bag season. We gonna give give a reason. I'll see you guys on the next one. We're going, we're going before you already know it. It's MCR. We're about to get out the car. Let's go.